Hello, everybody. Hello. Can you all hear us? Please Mike say check. yes. Mic check. Anybody? We're being heard. We're being yeah, heard. Yes, we're being heard. We're Please. being heard. Okay, so we're actually in the Fat Talk offices today. So this is not my setup. This is we literally spent the last, I don't know, 30 minutes stumbling around. Panicking. Oh, Panicking, flailing. Yeah, and, and, and flailing around a little bit. Oh, am I echoey? Is that better? Teething problems. This is definitely a, a fat check stream. Yeah, yeah. Maybe yeah. you have to mute one. Is okay. that better? Can you hear both of us? Can you stop? Better? Yeah, it's the. It's, it's sharing mics. This is well, sorry, every Fat Shark stream. When I was a community member, that's how Fat Shark stream started. That's how we do it. That's how that's we do how it. We roll. So there is this little dedicated stream room. The wall behind us is green. And we found these like little. <laughs> we found these things and this, this, I don't know. I'm going to call him Bob. Yeah, it's definitely not Raphael. I don't know where Raphael is. Raphael's the big rotund one, right? Yeah, yeah, the, yeah. the big plushy one. Fat shark. So whoever like comes up with the best name for this black tip shark, we will message you and you can win a cosmetic of your choice. Yeah, but it can't be black tip because that's the name of the meeting room in the office. So okay, we actually. <laughs> And I'm not wearing my usual outfit. No, I actually was a little afraid to bring my jacket here. It's kind of heavy and I didn't want to put it in a suitcase. And it's really summery here in Sweden today. It is really it's nice. Roasty hot. Um, uh, I'm gonna, they say one mic hedge is quite low. So maybe we have to like play mic. Mic, bingo. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So s snarky, call the shark Sigma. Sigma. Sig Sigmar, Sigmar. Mook? Chum, I like chum. Mm -hmm. Maybe we Lord can... Sharptooth the Fat, I like that one. I think I think that could be the one. I think that's the winner. Who is that? Wackiest Whale Zero. I'm gonna write that down. We're playing like bongo. Here we go. We're playing like uh, Mike, Mike Bongo here. Yeah, I'll, um, we'll get in touch with you uh, after the stream and find out what cosmetic you want. It's a good name. We're going to keep it. Just make sure you have your, your Twitch DMs open. Mm -hmm. All right. So originally we had planned like a little office tour, but this camera here is actually stationary. It's like sitting on, as I believe Tim described as sitting on a golden throne. The golden throne by the emperor. That's it, yes. So we could not show you the office, but uh, we moved into... It's the same office, we just took over more floors. Yeah, we just expand. Yeah. So we don't really have a... You know, usually I have a big script here, but there's no script. We're going to hang out, we're going to chat with you guys, share a little bit of news, and I'm going to have Leo as our guest today. That is me. And I, when was the last time you were on a Fat Shark stream? Ooh, it must have been about 18 months ago. 18 months. Mm. That's a very exact number. Yeah, I mean, it's give or take, but it's it's about then. It would have been... Ooh. Winds of Magic, maybe? Yeah, maybe a little after Winds of Magic, but it's been a while. It's been a while. So both of us are located in different areas, not in Sweden. So your trip is how long to get to Sweden? Two hours. Two hours, three hours, three hours. Three hours, three hours, and mine's about ten hours, so. Yeah. Your mic is off, by the way. I'm gonna have to just play ping pong with it all the time. Yeah, yeah, maybe I'm just gonna put my mic over here, and that way, I think maybe you need to be close to your mouth. Maybe, maybe. How's that? Did we good? It's all very complicated. It's a very, very complicated setup. You guys can't see it, but there's like three different lights and a camera and mics and two, four, five monitors and a sound mixer. Yeah. Yeah, and not much aircon because otherwise it would be blasting through the microphone. So it's going to get warm. I'm trying to figure out how we could not make it echoey, but I don't think there's a real, a real option here, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. 
Alrighty, so... I just, there's probably like a mic in front of my face, so the stream stuff is over here. I'm looking at the game because we are going to play a little bit. I tried bribing Leo to play, but... Not today. Not today? Not today. How about tomorrow? Yeah, maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow? Hmm. Oh, that's because we're not streaming. Yeah. I could maybe take the time to get good. <laughs> Well, one day we, we, will, we will teach you how yeah. to play. Well, may, maybe we can do a series or something, teach Hedge how to get good. You sound spicy, though. Uh, I laughed at about three seconds. That's still, you still did slightly. I gave it a go. You gave it a go. You gave it a go. It was embarrassing. <laughs> and speaking of, the someone says you sound like Kruber. Kruber. We actually live not too far away in, in the UK, so it makes sense. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so tournament is tomorrow for you guys who want to watch spicy stuff. Um, and by spicy, I mean modded spicy, not heretical spicy. Mm -hmm. I, we, we have seen your screenshots. I know what you're posting on Reddit. And Sigmar disapproves. Definitely. You make our animator cry. Yes. <laughs> so that is tomorrow and Sunday. They got a good number of teams signed up. That will be hosted over on twitch.tv slash fight the tide. And also you can watch it on Steam. Like if you go to the Steam store page, it'll be there as well. Alright, so let's get into this interview with you. Um, you were the OG community manager before I came on. I was. How, did, how did this kind of start? Yeah, so I mean Fat Shark hadn't had a community manager up until I joined. Um, so that would have been early 2016. Uh, Vermintide 1 had not, had not long been out and um, a lot of people, a lot more people came to the party uh, than I think Fat Shark expected and needed someone to sort of jump in and, and sort of wrangle the community and have fun and, and, and pass on all the valuable feedback in, in the way that's useful for the team. Um, and yeah, that's been now six years, six years and two months, I think. Um, and it's been a wild ride. We've, we've seen some cool stuff. Vermintide 1 grew from strength to strength. Um, followed up with Vermintide 2, uh, which millions of people have come and enjoyed. Um, it's been a real, a real journey, and what with Dark Tide coming up in a, but a few months, um, the journey is going to continue. And uh, the team just had to expand, so we managed to wrangle the beautiful Ak Akshi into action, and um, it's been brilliant. Um, you've been an incredible, valuable help to the team. So I've turned my mic up a little bit. Is that a little better? Yeah, okay. Are we good? So I think we need to do that. One, two, one, two. Just teething problems. I'm going to assume that that's better. Yeah, okay. So these are different mics. We, we have a, I don't know what you have, but I have a, a Blue Yeti. So it's a little bit different. I have an... Elgato something. I haven't actually managed to use it yet, but I will. It's time will come. You just need to scream into the mic like I do, apparently. Oh, I can do it. Okay, so how how did you like? Wh where did you come in, in in terms of the Vermintide timeline? Um, so it was after launch of Vermintide one. Um, before that, there was no one really able to sort of jump into the thick of things so actually a lot of the fat sharks themselves were spending time pouring through forums and trying to get involved and figure out what it was people were were asking for or saying or feeding back on on the game um and they realized they just needed a dedicated resource to do that um it's fairly commonplace these days but you know the, the, the studio was growing at the time um i think we were maybe 40 people then and um i think we're approaching 200 now yeah um, it's a little over 200 maybe yeah 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 um, so it was about then really, yeah, just after the launch of, of Burn 1, um, which was, uh, I mean, far and away Fat Shark's biggest game at the time um, that they'd ever had. Um, yeah, it was, it's been a wild journey. Oh, I remember asking you this question when I was a community member, but what is it like being a community manager? What is it like? It's brilliant. Um, I mean, it's a job where you don't really need any discernible talents in terms of like coding or scripting or mixing audio or doing anything kind of complicated with with software and maths and logic. 
Um, it's more about language and compassion and being able to understand what it is that people want from your game and being able to sort of transpose that in a way that developers can make use of it. And um, I mean, thankfully, those are language skills that I, have, I, I guess I do have or, or, or like to try and hone in. Um, and all my life I've been playing games and I've been a part of the gaming community. So being someone responsible for sort of leading that charge is, is, is a wonderful thing. It's a wonderful feeling um, and really rewarding when it when things go right, it's really re rewarding. And when things go wrong, it's really scary. But, um, <laughs> you know, turning the ship around is always a really exciting thing to do. Oh, well, what, what would you say is your favorite part of being a community manager if you had to like pinpoint a highlight? Oh, I think releasing something. I think the very first time you put a, open the doors to your game and watch the people pour in and just that it's overwhelming. Like you can be drowned very easily, but Learning to swim in that tide is really a remarkable feeling. Um, the vermin tide. The vermin tide, exactly, <laughs> and the dark tide. Um, I mean, you've seen it with releases we've had. There mm -hmm. is a there is a magic about showing something to the to the public for the first time, um, and and being a community manager, you're kind of you're the first person that they're talking to, and it's and it's it is a truly wonderful feeling. Um, Bear in mind that I didn't make any of this stuff. I didn't do any of the clever stuff. I'm not the talented artist or the, you know, the, I don't do any of that stuff, but I get to be a big part of it in a different way. Um, See, your favorite part is different than my favorite part. What's your favorite part? I like getting clown emojis on Steam. That way I can use the Steam points to decorate my profile. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's easy to farm clown emojis. It's just good fun. No. Um, I, I think the seeing community hosted events is probably my favorite thing, mm. kind of coming from that area. Cool. And it's, I just, I like when people come together to put their effort into something that makes people excited or happy. Like I, I'm, I'm a bit of a people pleaser, so I, I like seeing people happy and kind of seeing people upset makes me upset. So it's like, oh no, the community's unhappy. What do I do? Yeah, yeah, it's tough. It, it takes some, it takes adjusting to, um, but I think, that's where we kind of complement each other. We have really different uh, goals, I think, and interests when it comes to how community teams work. And I think that'll really, I think we're going to vibe really well. Yeah, yeah. All right, so let's kind of talk about a little bit of FAQ and some of the things that have been asked about us. Mm -hmm. And people have been asking us about where is Sienna's new career? Sure. So, I mean, we're kind of approaching that time, right, where a lot of the careers have sort of been coming your way every sort of six to seven months. And uh, I think we're in month five since uh, Warrior Priest came out. So I, I can appreciate that a lot of people are chomping at the bit to find out what's next for Sienna. Um, we're going to be real, though. Uh, there is going to be a longer time between Warrior Priest and uh, Sienna's new career. Um, we've got some stuff coming up sort of plug the gap um we're not quite ready to talk about what that is yet but it's coming fairly soon um but do expect to wait a little bit longer uh for sienna's fourth career um a bit of insight into why you know we're ramping up for what is potentially the biggest release um we've ever done with dark tide and uh, a fair few uh, members of the vermintide team are sort of chipping in to kind of make sure the game gets ready for release, um, share their experiences with building Vermintide and uh, helping, I guess, do that final stretch to get Dark Tower out the door in the, in the best way it can with the highest level of polish it can have. Um, and that will come at a cost to some of the production on Vermintide, but uh, we're not done and there's stuff still to come before Dark Tide comes out um, in Verm World. Um, but yeah, just to be real, that there's, there's going to be a longer wait between uh, this career versus all of the previous ones. Um. So someone asked, is it stuff for everyone or stuff only for PC? It's, it's stuff for everyone. Stuff for it's everyone. for everyone. And I, I think you all will like the everyone stuff. I hope you all like the everyone stuff. Should be pretty cool. Can you give us a hint about the new Sienna? It's Sienna. Yeah. Yeah. It's her fourth career. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I shouldn't have found that so amusing. That's all we can say. Yeah, yeah. You're welcome to guess, though. Um, we won't tell you if you're right. We might tell you if you're wrong, if you're really obviously wrong. But uh, I can tell you there isn't a frying pan. There is no frying pan. 
Does she have the? Yes, yeah, she has the same last name. Yeah. I, I can confirm her name is Sienna Fuego Nicholas. Mm -hmm. That yeah. much is true. Yeah, that is true. Can confirm. Can confirm. So the other questions we have were what kind of what kind of goes on in the shark tank now that we're making dark tide right now i mean a lot there is a lot going on we've got people flying around in mocap suits um wait we do yeah well not flying not like, <laughs> i was gonna say i missed that part not actually flying but zooming around um that's a fairly regular occurrence is yeah people in these strange looking outfits um just doing recordings like in the middle of hallways and stuff it's kind of bizarre you know you've got people coding and then whoo, someone comes down in an accent suit and yeah i mean it's hard to explain um yeah there's all sorts going on i mean whoo. oh hello hi i'm being instructed this way Speak into it. So if you can't see, we have... I'll just hide behind yeah, it. Yeah. We are having some professional help from being watched from upstairs. From, uh, let me fix this for you. From Fat Shark Tim. Everyone remembers Tim. Tim, come say hi. Hello. I I have a beard now. He has a beard. <laughs> well, no of us. Yeah. <laughs> see, yeah. I haven't gotten the beard yet. When do I get the beard? Like, how many, how many months do I need to be? 12 months. 12 months? Yeah. Okay. Do I get a refund if I don't? No. No? No refunds. Uh oh, okay. No refunds. And the mics are really sensitive, so you definitely put them inside. It's a must. It's like, here, there's very heavy. Here, That's really complicated, man. It's, it's very, you have to like... But they could all hear me in, in, in this one. Yeah, I don't know. It's fine. <laughs> it's boo! <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> this stream is rated M for mature. <laughs> They probably didn't hear you though, because you weren't talking into the mic, so it's oh, fine. I was angry for him. Yeah. He said terrible things. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. Keep it up. Thank Cheers, you. Tim. Nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Skeleton is asking, how are the body pillars? We have to know. Uh, they are hidden by Tuva still. I haven't seen them. They're hidden. <laughs> they're, they're hidden. They've been hidden. But there's, they are here, and they will make yeah. a resurgence. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah. We have more floors now. We can find them. Yeah, one we, for each floor. Yeah. 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 But send us more. We love them. I love them. I, I thought they were great. They're brilliant. <laughs> Cheers, Tim. Hey, thank you. Talk. So we have a... Uh, <laughs> when we were setting up this stream, usually like... No, no. This place is pretty chill, but when you're like, hey, we're going to do a stream, no one poked their head in. And everyone's like, what are you doing in there? How are you doing? Yeah, what's what going guys, on? Are you, are you streaming? <laughs> Who, who's that Gree? Why does head remind me of Alex Horn so much? I, That is the most flattering thing I think I've ever heard of. I really appreciate that. Do you know who Alex Horn is? Uh, is this an actor? No. He does like panel shows and like comedy and... Um, like quizzes but he's quintessential british tv it's so on tv yeah 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 Yeah, i don't have a tv so no i don't know who that is i will give you the rundown later on it's okay good stuff. okay okay good stuff yeah i appreciate the comparison <laughs> so can you tell us about what's different in the office now because we started out in this i wouldn't say it was tiny but yeah, I mean, we we start when I was here. I think we just had one floor, so one floor of like a five-story building. Um, not long after I joined, um, we absorbed the floor. I think below us, and then built stairs through, and then we took the floor above the original floor, and then I think moved some stuff into the attic above that and then have recently invaded the ground floor of the building. So we're just missing one piece of the puzzle, which is kicking out the neighbors downstairs and moving in there as well. Wait, the basement people? Uh, the first floor. The first, first floor. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, so we just need, yeah, we just need a reason to get rid and we'll just scoop in smoother and this whole building will be ours. Um, but maybe in the future. Um, but it has grown, like there are so many more people here now and 
all of them incredibly wickedly talented um it's an honor to walk amongst them and swim amongst them i should say swim amongst them is leo hedge leo is hedge it's true it's true how did you feel about being put in the game what is a thorn sister alt yeah um it was an honor it was an honor and a privilege um, as divisive as, as it is, but then I'm also quite a divisive person, so it kind of makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you had to choose a talent, which which hedge would you be? Uh, probably razor thicket, I imagine. Razor thicket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Quite sharp edged. Yeah. I I appreciate that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty, so we are gonna do a bit of games. Maybe, maybe I can get you to play. No, I. There's no chance of me getting you to play. Not today. Not today. Maybe next time. We can do, like I say, this tutorial challenge. Okay, we, we can, can do the tutorial. Teach Hedge how to get good. So will we have more for le each character in the future? I can confirm there is more lore on the way. Our lovely loner never stops writing in his journal. He's actually on pause at the moment. He is, Alicia's. Yeah, Alicia's. Alicia's being transcribed. Mm -hmm. I, we, we all know you love to hear her voice in Return to Uber Strike. Yep. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Equally as divisive. Someone is complimenting your taste in the music. Do you get a new map? I'm gonna have to wait and see. So, marketing is downstairs and they're watching us. And if we like reveal too much, remember when I spoke about assassin rats? They, they work They work for the marketing department. They're gonna like jump out of this wall, mm -hmm. this green screen, mm -hmm. and that'll be the end of us. You'll have no more community mm -hmm. managers. It's true. It is true. Wait, is my Spotify still streaming on um, Discord? It does. Oh man. Oh no. <laughs> Well, I'm sorry, but not sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you might not see his, his Spotify anymore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do listen to some terrible stuff. All right, let's get into some games here. Mm -hmm. And again, I... This is your first time watching me play in person, I think. Maybe? No, I saw you play... Was I making faces? Uh, it was at Christmas. That's when I played Spicy. Okay. Well, then, yeah, I was probably making faces. Yeah, yeah. That will not change here. That's fine. No. I will also make faces, but probably for different reasons. <laughs> um, yeah, also, this is probably not an account you're familiar with. Is this the Fat Shark account? This is the Fat Shark account, but I don't think it's got the wonderful world of everything on it. I, th I think they boosted us, actually. Oh, did they? Yeah, nice. they, I, I asked. So, as a developer, you get special privileges, and you can go to QA and be like, hey, I need crafting materials. Give so me the things. Yeah, so the way this works is it's like when you're in live game, you can't be like, hey, QA, put some stuff in my personal account. But here we have things like production tests, we have internal tests, we have company-wide tests, and each one uses a different client. And so you kind of have to go to QA, otherwise you start from square one each time. So I told QA, hey, put something in the Fat Shark account. But when you tell QA to put in crafting materials or something in the Fat Shark account, they don't just put in, oh, here's 50 red dust. They put in like 1,500 yeah. red dust. All of the dust. All of the dust, all of the dust, all of the crafting materials. And someone is like, dev cheats, there's no way you can get that much dust. It's shh. <laughs> we can do whatever we want. Yeah. So actually cheating confirmed. 100%. Yeah, yeah. I, I sold my my ethics to to get good at Verm. Mm -hmm. That's, that's just, yeah. It's just how we roll. <laughs> and yeah, I, I do have a, a dev portrait. I thought you knew that, Ishka. Alrighty, let's get into it. And I'm going to move our, our new friend here. Already. Bam. I am the stream master. That shark is not fat. We need to plump him up a little bit more. That is so. Raphael is our mascot. He is the nice rotund one. I'm not sure where he is though. That's his 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 scrawny little brother. Yeah. Second cousin. 
second cousin. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see how the, I don't know how I'm gonna play this with a mic in front of my face, but we're gonna try. So, <clears throat> whoa, I can't talk and play at the same time very well, particularly with this setup. So, over to me. You leave it to you, nice. and I. You guys can torture me with Twitch and put in your stuff. We need to change the stream title. Do we? Probably. I think, uh, yeah, I'll. I'll have to scooch. <laughs> So, again, there's two monitors in front of me, and there's three monitors here, and they're pushed on, like, two different desks. And normally the way this works is we have two people here, and we have Tuva, who you've seen in previous streams, manning the stream. So it's just the two of us today. This Twitch is in Sweden. I tried to get Hedge to play, but he... He said no, but in the future, we are going to have a little series of Hedge Plays Vermintide, and we are going to teach him from square one how to play. Is there a possibility a studio tour comes later in form of video? That was actually the plan for this stream. And again, me not being in the office, I did not realize that the camera we have is permanently mounted on a like tripod so yes if i can get my hand on a camera that's mobile i will make that happen all ready you ready oh you mean teaching <laughs> oh okay that sounds difficult i mean teaching <laughs> ouch no no one is no one is beyond beyond not learning berm i promise you i i actually might be no you're not you're i might not. be you're i not. can't actually log into twitch right now you can't log into twitch no 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 huh uh, nice yeah it will take some finagling to get it working okay so so pr pretend that pr there is a thing pretend that the date is correct okay so what character do you all want me to play Sienna? Easy. 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 Huntsman? Okay, there's, there's more Huntsman than Sienna here. Oh my god, there's already people in here. I was not prepared. Okay, let me turn the sound up. Oh my gosh, who is playing on negative 6.5? So I need to change all my key bands here, so... Hmm, there's no sound again. I swear there was sound a bit ago. We might have to be like flying flying with no sound here. Can can you all hear the sound or is it just us? It just has no sound. I heard the clicking before, but I don't hear it anymore. They can't hear the game sound either. There's like no sound. Tim. There is clicking sounds in the menu. You can hear the clicking sounds in the menu. Okay, I hear the clicking sound now. Okay, there's sound, there's sound. They might not be able to hear it. They can hear it. Okay, cool, cool. I think we're okay. Okay, let me, they're gonna see my abomination of a keybind, okay? Actually, I have to set up your mouse to do this. Oh my gosh. Ah! So, in my defense, I learned to play on a controller. Um, let's see, Alt-Tab. I can't move it. I'm trying to get to the your mouse here. Okay, cool. No, my dodge is not on mouse wheel. Mine, mine aren't that abominated. <laughs> um, everything's in Swedish. <laughs> oh. oh my goodness. Okay. Um, let's see.
It's tricky, huh? Hmm? It's all very tricky. Especially when everything's in Swedish and uh, neither of us speak it. Yeah, I, I do not speak <laughs> Swedish, I'll be honest. Trying to think here. This is Yeah, so those looking to join the game, we would normally rotate people out after each map. Um so if we have the stamina to do more than one run, we'll probably say goodbye to the people in the lobby and then uh bring in a, a fresh batch. Okay. I'm going to let you go back to the game because I don't know how you did it. And then... Bam. Thank you. Alrighty, so... Did we expect the DRG homies in a fat shark stream? Um, I guess not, but it's always a pleasure. Um, we actually want to do a bit more work with those guys and maybe play a bit of DRG. Well, would, you, would you guys be cool if we played some Deep Rock on a Fat Shark stream one day? Um, we're up for it, if, if you are. Let's see. Da, da, da. Wait. There's a little bit of a lag on... Here. I think people also want to see us play some DRG. So there you go. Yeah, we're up for that. It's a good game. They do it well. I don't know what their Twitch integration is like. Is it any good? Usually this is always already set up at home. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I've seen. I've seen. I didn't know it wasn't official, but I, I, then I, I must have seen the mod for Twitch. Okay, integration. I think that's it. Do they work in a similar way to Vermintide's Twitch integration, or are they kind of a different take on it? Did it apply it? I don't know. Maybe. I'm going to assume it did. Channel points to spawn enemies in game. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay. Oh my goodness, I definitely do have nothing. Okay. We're, we're, we're going to make this work with a two-handed hammer, okay? And... This isn't the best loadout, but we'll, we'll make it work. <laughs> ah, this is going to be so painful with a two-handed hammer. All right. I'm pretty sure this is where that needs to be. We're going to wear the shark hat. Standard. The best hat. Mm -hmm. And then let us get Twitch going. All right, and what do we want to play? Do we want to play uh, Kata or do we want to play Legend? Recruit <laughs> Kata Chaos Waste. Chaos Waste might take a little too long, but I'm going to have Cheese carry me. It'll be fine. A Cheese carry?
I'm just gonna change these video settings down real quick because I think that's causing some yeah I was wondering why this is a little bit <laughs> uh, it moved it to the other. Thank you. Okay. Wait. I forgot my uh, my my FOV. Too many settings. I'm still a console player at heart, clearly. I can see Fat Shark Julia in there trying to make me play Cataclysm. Not today. But one day, but one day, everyone will have educated me to the point in which I can just true solo it. That's the goal. Uh -huh. Okay, I'm gonna let you do that one time. So what was it? Windows Con Shift and left arrow. Windows Shift and left arrow. Got it. One of the, the strongest Windows keybinds. Is Hed Hedge the voice actor for something? Yes. No, I, I mean, I wish I was that talented. Um, no, that is uh, Tim. Old Tim. Not that Tim. Not Tim. Fat Shark Tim. Um, Yeah, I wish I wish I had the voice the of, on here? of our salt spire. I saw you had a switch. I did have a switch. What did you do with it? Oh my god. Yeah. I don't have a switch. I mean you can switch if you want and then turn Do the blowing ladder? Um potentially. I know I'm asking the wrong question here. Hard to say. Couldn't tell you. I'm going to yeah, say a little yes. Bit. Why is my mouse not working? Oh my gosh, why is the delay so long? Okay. Something is very strange about this mouse. I think it's maybe the driver needs to be updated. We'll see. Yeah, I mean, the, I the did just install it, but it might have needed a bit of a reboot or something. Yeah, the we're, we're gonna play with a little bit of delay. It's fine. Like it seems to work. It's I think it's a the the computer's trying very difficult, very very hard. <laughs> oh, that's unplayable. It feels terrible. That is unplayable. <laughs> no, Silver Fox. I did not do a salty impression, and no amount of Swedish Chrono will get me to do one today. We're going to make it work. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is like... <laughs> that is... It, it feels bad, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what's going on there. A Merry Bucks? I'm not sure really how many a Merry Bucks it would I don't take. think this is a mouse. It feels like the... The CPU is... Smoking. Yeah, I don't know how many uh, a Merry Bucks it would take <laughs> Ishka, to make me do a... The, the, this, is, this, this is the new tournament mode. What, intermittent mouse? Maybe it's a new Twitch mode vote. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. This is like... <laughs> that, 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 that was big brain. Still doing better than I would be doing. <laughs>
<laughs> Would you rather a janky mouse or a mouse without the appropriate buttons? Because I can put the other mouse back I in. I think want. I would rather have the mouse without the appropriate button. I can switch it over if you want. Yeah, let's do that next one. That looks like a, a horror it's, movie. It's very painful. <laughs> what did you do? Oh my goodness. It, it's it's the mouse I play with at home, the same kind. It's a 502, a G502. Okay. Oh god. Oh my god, the sensitivity is all different. This is much better, just in a different way. Oh my god. No, I think- I don't think it's a mouse issue. I think this is a CPU issue. No. Yeah, because it's the, the mouse is... Jankity jank. Okay, that that might be it. Nope, nope. It's still, it's still not like reading the mouse movement. Man, this is this is definitely uh, a stream gone wrong. Yeah, yeah. Maybe after this, or if we want to tap out, we can just reboot the PC or something. Yeah, let's uh, let's tap out real quick. Ah, uh, yeah. It's not even. It's yeah. I can see now. Yeah, Recon, I think it's probably a QA issue. I think we can all safely blame them. <laughs> I don't think this is your fault. Wow. Crazy. I wonder what just happened here. <laughs> Wild. Uh, whoa. What? I was not expecting you to have a hat. I'm not wearing a hat. Let me tell you about that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so do you just kind of want to restart this? Yeah, I think so. I think it probably makes sense. Um, we can probably do it through through the traditional means. Mm, I guess we can plug this guy back in since it's not this guy. This mm. guy isn't an issue. We've lost chat. <gasps> oh my God. <laughs> So for Dark Tide, I can tell you that the machine, the update machine is revving up and you guys will have more news soon. We, we the Dark Tide team will just be very upset if we spoil stuff mm -hmm. for them and not let them have their moment of glory. There is a plan, there is a game plan. And um, you know, if you're following the social media channels or if you're hopped into Discord, you'll be seeing some things happening. So. Um, just make sure you keep an eye, keep an eye out there, and feel free to try and dissect what you find. Uh. <laughs> Thank you. Um, is the shark hack going to become available again at some point? Um, eh, I mean, never say never, but probably not. Um, we, we, 
there is some hesitation about sort of re-releasing things like that that have that, are, that were sort of a, a one-time event um like i say it's not to say that it it may never happen but i wouldn't hold your breath um yeah just in case okay so Stumpies are, if, if you're looking to uh, impact the, the Twitch votes, um, so when Akshi is playing again, um, you will see at the bottom like hashtag A for one thing and hashtag B for another. If you just drop hashtag A or hashtag B uh, into chat, you will influence uh, the vote. Um, the most votes wins. And if it's a draw, I think it's a coin toss. I think it is a coin yeah. toss, yeah. It's there we go. Hmm. Okay, so I would move that mouse off the cable, otherwise you're gonna be double mousing. Like that? Yeah. Are nice. you saying I'm not advanced enough to use two mice? Well may maybe. Maybe I could use one mouse and you use the other. How do the inputs act would it do that? Would it would it we both inputs? Yeah. I'm not sure if it all balance them out or like do what if average. i use the mouse and you use the keyboard now that would be spicy <laughs> it's its own level of twitch mode that that that's that's what we're gonna have to do the next time we're mm. gonna stream. it would be like the do you remember those youtube challenges where someone was like a pair of hands and they'd have to make like a recipe without the other person looking good content Yeah, I think Let's see if we can get past the keep first. Yeah, yeah. This feels a lot more normal already. Just turn it off and on again. That's always a winner. Vermin tied with a flight stick when? I think didn't someone... Uh, okay, let's try this again, guys. I think someone modified some uh, like Joy-Cons for the Wii and played Vermin tied with those. That looked pretty cool. Um, but flight stick, I think that could work. V2 with the dance mat is the true best controller. Mm -hmm. So for a long time, I said if I could figure it out, I would play Vermintide on a fight stick. I don't think there's enough buttons, though. You'd have to set up some sort of like macro so that two buttons did another action, and then you could, it would become some sort of... Yeah, I'd pay to see that, actually. Do you think uh, IT would help me set that up? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, we'll get Frank on it. So, fun fact, there is a Vermintide VR. It's a, it's a wave shooter, I think, but there is a Vermintide VR and it's free. Yeah, it is. I think all you need is to... Do you even need to... Yeah, you do need to own Vermintide 1. Um, but yeah, it's otherwise free. Oh, you also need a VR set. Uh, but yeah, I think there's a rail shooter, like an on-rail shooter. Um, and uh, like a... I mean, kind of tower defense, but you're the tower. Um... Mm, it's pretty cool. Hero Trials, that's right. That's right. I tried it once. It made me nauseous, but it wasn't the game's uh, no, fault. No, we're it still was... having trouble with this mouse. Or is it with, like, it just doesn't read my inputs. Hello? There is a mouse here, and it's supposed to work. What about it... the other one? Hmm? What about the other one? Well, this worked in the keep. Yeah, you're right. What have you done to my mouse? This works. I haven't done anything to your mouse. My poor mouse. What happens if you unplug that mouse? Do you want me to try? Yeah. BRB. Yeah, this is what happens when you learn from controller and put all your buttons, all the keys on your buttons. Mm. See, I think you'd have an easier time playing. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's just not reading like the left and right. <laughs> it doesn't read any of my inputs. Nice. I'm getting assassinated. <laughs> this is great. Well, I can't view them either. So this one, this one works. Ah, I'd have to reset my keybinds again. I'm just gonna watch these people play. <laughs> well, while I'm here, I will I will do this. So, uh, as long as I have a dodge, I'll be fine. Okay, we're gonna try that, and then I'm gonna have to bring this down because I don't know where the... We'll see. This is a little bit more manageable. Hmm. Yeah, it's not hitching up now at least. I do use dodge on a mouse. See, this is where people are going to come in and tell me how to do my keybinds. <laughs> it's this is why when I'm at home, no one sees what my keybinds are bound to because they're just abominations. I actually have um, dodge bound to my face. Dodge bound to your face? Yeah, so I have to... Like, it's, it's just how I play. Maybe that's where I'm going wrong. I don't know. <laughs> I, I'm going to call him out because I, I appreciate what he's doing now, but... When we were troubleshooting bio, he, he was like, oh, just use this mouse button. I don't have that. Turns out he was playing on a regular keyboard now. Oh, bio. <laughs> Nod twice if you're getting Sienna Sister of the Sigma. That's three nods, by the way. Yeah, I counted them. That was definitely three. Everything's on a different spot. <laughs> oh, we're gonna learn new keybinds now. <laughs> hey, Alex. Yeah, we're all doing good. We're having some uh, some mouse input issues, um, but other than that, all good. All good. How you doing? It's very strange. Like I keep hitting my middle mouse button to reload. Oh my god, I can't even climb ladders anymore. What just? Oh, hello. Ooh, surprise! <laughs> I can't play like this. We're playing a custom difficulty, uh, Simo the Brave, which is, I think, Legend Twitch enabled uh, Cataclysm with broken inputs. <laughs> and you were telling everyone in the office that she's so good at Vermintide. I know, yeah, I threw you under the bus. I'm sorry. Um, I'm, there might be some sticky tape under the mouse or something. It's the sort of thing that uh, Eric in QA does. Oh my god, that comes up. There's cat hair. I have a very hairy cat. <laughs> yeah, you know comes off? <laughs> I had no idea that. Yeah, is that where the weights go? Yeah. Oh, but there you go. I'm learning something How long every have you day. Had this? Um, a couple of years, I think. But yeah, I learn something every day. Uh, will broken inputs be added as a deed modifier? 
Um, I can't say I recommend it. Yeah, but you're always welcome to pop round here and uh, we can show you what it's like. Let me see where I'm located. Okay, I got some time, so I'm gonna... Yeah, Mortal Kombat did have a control mix-up mode. I mean, they are really off, like, almost nauseating uh, to get to grips with. Um, yeah, I think it would be impossible. Unless they were kind of predictable. If, you could, if they were just 100% reversed, I think you could get used to it. But if they were different sort of randomized mix-ups each time, it would just, uh, it would be infuriating. Yeah, you can enable it by dropping soup on your keyboard, but uh, we can't cover the warranty, I'm afraid. This mouse seems to be working fine now. I don't understand why there's not a, like a another button here that would just I, I would be able to use it hmm. can we buff zealot um we can't unfortunately um yeah we don't have we don't have the power So I guess on the question of uh, Sienna's next career, um, what would you guys want it to be? Any thoughts? Steam tank, precess of Mamidia, a buffed pyro. Something bald. Some interesting choices. Star I want that. Yeah. I want it. Star Belly was all in on Master Griller. Um, yeah, sorry, sorry. Pus fume, Sienna. That would be interesting. I'm not sure how it would work, but I'd, I'd play it. Vedna's day, give her firearms, not stuff. Do you mean arms made of fire or like pew, pew, pew. guns? I 
have said, probably have an easier time playing on a controller than a PC watch. We have one we can plug in if you want. Do we? Mm -hmm. Oh man, the console players would love that. Are there plans uh, to make Chaos Waste not punish Zealot? Like give him a key to turn real health into temp health or something? Um, I mean, there aren't plans for it, but it is a common bit of feedback we hear is that often a, a Zealot isn't always... I think I killed cheese. No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> it's not always like in control of their, their you know, their health. Um, yeah, it's something we relate a lot. Um, it's just not, I don't think, been at the top of the list. Like, it's a co-op game, so maybe, you know, a bit of a communication as to... Asking people not to do certain things. I get in chaos waste. It's, it's not always in anyone's control, but that's kind of the nature of the place. Um, yeah. Just shoot the zealot. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Yeah, I quite like the idea of a zealot that can sort of self-flagellate. It would be thematic, I think. Nair, if if he can self flatulate, what is the what is non self flatulating? Or do I not want to know? You're saying flatulation, right? I am now, yeah. But that's Nair's fault. Okay, I thought you were saying something there to light. I mean I'm gonna worry about it now. I'm gonna it's gonna keep me awake. I need to know. I don't know what that was. I don't know if anyone heard that. But it sounded expensive. GG. Do you want a pad? What? Do you want a pad? Game pad? Yeah, let's, that might be a little bit easier. <laughs> Played on the gamepad in like two years. This is for the, the, the console ones. I'm gonna need a beer after this at this point. <laughs> oh god. It is Xbox, but it's the same button. Alright, let's see. Yeah, all things considered, that was a good this one. This doesn't seem to work. Oy. So if you unplug this mouse and put this mouse where this mouse was, does it work? We can try. <laughs> Of course they have beer in Sweden. <gasps> it's working. It's working. It's working. <laughs> Just, just don't, don't, 
Don't think anything just yet. We're gonna see how it is when it's on the map. Okay. Also, the audio is very low. Okay, so key bindings. We're gonna try this again. Uh, this is T. This is T C. I'm trying to think of what my other things were. Okay, and that would be weapon swap. That's what it was. Options. Quick swap. Okay. Now we're going to try this. We're now now go. we're going to make this work. We're, we're going to play on... Uh, an easy mode character just just to make sure just to make sure this works okay let's do it so Stumpy asked if Lona drops hints on possible future content I mean he has doesn't mean that everything he says is a hint to future content, but he has done. Um, and he may again. I'm going to cry if this doesn't work. <laughs> it looks good. I feel confident this is now set up appropriately. That's definitely not how the English keyboard works, but you know. We need to guess what Cheese's next guide is going to be. Maybe Lona will tell us. What? Maybe Lona will tell us. Lona what? Lona will tell us what Cheese's next guide is. He'll drop hints. He'll drop hints? Yeah, yeah. What if Lona is next? Is Sienna's next <laughs> That'd be great. He does know a lot. He's got fingers in many pies. What about the undead hinted at the end of Vermintide 1? This has not been confirmed internally, so I'm just going to say what my theory is. Is I think Sophia is the necromancer that killed Ruby's oh, his regiment. I asked and no one's told me. They won't even tell the community managers. Because we're loose lipped. But there's plenty laying around down there. In this show to the left. I shall be glad to get it. Oh, Alright, worse ways to earn a living than this, mate. Apparently, that is indeed the Royale with cheese. The very same. The one and only. So the first time I played this map, I actually, like, just completely destroyed myself going down the ladder, and then I was kicked. I still do. It's 50-50 as to whether I make it down the ladder intact or with shattered ankles. Filthy 
I have the best move tech right now. Always sneaking, stabbing. This isn't a random loadout mod. Um, we could maybe ask actually why she chose what she did, but I think she's just laser focused. In. Unless you're talking about the rest of the lobby, they might just be memeing. And when I say I have the best move tech, I mean I have none at all. <laughs> move tech is overrated anyway. You're going to make some people angry with that statement. <laughs> like I say, I'm divisive. Hooks. That hook tried to pull a versus maneuver or something. <laughs> Coming from above. Oh look! It's a patrol! I might have gotten myself in a bad spot here. Yeah, that looks pickly. Pro gamer move. I'm not quite as good as shout cast as at shout casting as Ishka is, I'm afraid. Yeah, the only issue with firebombs is you're just not throwing them hard enough. It's all about the contact damage. Oh, I'm actually playing Hunger in the Dark as it's intended to be played. <laughs> oh. 
Did the lights just go out in here? And why? This room works in mysterious ways. I think they're telling us that maybe time is up. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was kind of eerie, though. Not gonna lie. Oh yeah, it could be that. Could be as you approach the dark section, the lights go out. It, it's true. I mean, grenades are quite heavy. If someone threw a grenade and it hit you in the head, it would sting. Is there any chance for a Forgotten Relics weapon pack too? It would, you would open up your wallet for that. Um, I mean, there's a chance, right? Uh, so let us. What do you think should be in that? What would you like? What other weapons would you like to see for the heroes? Oh, hello. Fire whip would be cool. I would like to see a fire whip mm. or fire claws. Have a care. That's a chaos warrior. Well, looks like that cart had enough of you, company. Come finish me if you dare. Yeah, side would be pretty cool. More ranged for Marcus. Anything in particular? Saw a grenade launcher up there. Rifle for salt. Yeah. Surely we're not about to abandon that rifle. Twin flail for zealot. Would that one to hit himself and one to hit everything else? Or? A big stick. Pokey stick or hitty stick? One at both. No, not both, one each end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fair. Angry rat tied to a stick. It's my kind of jam. Fish bat. Is that a bat made of fish or a fish attached to a bat? The bat is the fish. Okay. Any particular fish or do we have like creative freedom to select a suitable fish? Shout. Mackerel might be a bit small. A fat shark. No such thing. No such thing.
Okay. <laughs> Nobody saw. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Just walk it off. A herring? Why well, would it be pickled or fermented? You have to cut down the mightiest tree with it. Mm. Yeet! Oh. GG. GG. Frying pan to bonk rats. It is already on the modded realm. It's worth giving a go. I could go for a royale with cheese right now. It's pretty delicious. Mm. Sweden has a lot of good burger places. You you wouldn't think that like an American food would be so commonly found. I mean, it's my favorite food group. The burger, the humble burger, is it's my favorite food group. And all I've done this week is eat burgers and just meat and bread. That's been it. That's that's your standard standard meal, yeah. I love it. Meat and bread. We had like, how do you describe it? You're like, do you want sausage with bread on your hot dog? <laughs> Oh, it's not quite a hot dog, though. It's like, it's like the next level above a hot dog. Mm. Have I eaten at... Mormors. What is that? Uh, so down by the station, just to the left of the station, is a tiny... What do they serve? Burgers. Burgers? Mm. And they're kind of a religious icon in the office. Would you say it's the best burgers? Um, In... Stockholm, yeah, maybe. Um, that's that's a pretty pretty tall order. Yeah, it's it's right up there, and it's not the best burger place I've been to, but they are very good burgers. And if I say otherwise, I will be dead the moment I leave this room. So I have to, <laughs> I just have to. Max is a good burger, but it's more of a fast. It's it's like excellent fast food burger. As opposed to on the gourmet burger side of things. Mm -hmm. Sequence, there is nothing wrong with Max. Alrighty. Good day. And so far, it actually is. Do I want to play with a two handed sword or do I want to play with an axe falchion? So, someone wanted GK? Well, someone's on Grill Knight at the moment, so. Do we even have Grail Knight unlocked? That's always one of the classics on a Fat Shark stream. Oh my goodness, this is not an English keyboard. <laughs> we can fix. It's okay. I, I, I think it's, 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 people are probably finding it more amusing that I'm just saving everything. Okay, so. What kind of thing do we have here? Hmm. 
You want a hammer and great hammer. Okay. I don't know if I have a one hammer. One handed hammer. You must have the blacksmith one. <laughs> I, I can play with the blacksmith one if you guys want me to. <laughs> and the two handed hammer. Okay. They want two, one, two, three, one, one. Two, one. Two, three, one, one. Okay. Two, one, two. Three, one, one. Yeah, the mace is the one-handed hammer. <laughs> okay, this is a blacksmith one-handed hammer, but I'm not going to have you sit around and wait for a... for a roll, so. Do I have an orange one? No, that's a... that's a two-handed hammer. I don't have an orange mace. We'll just play with the blacksmith one and see where it gets us. <laughs> what would your kinsfolk be thinking? What would you out here when they're surely having Embrace the challenge. Right now, Uber's ranks got enough troubles without wondering why the water's a strange shade of Just get a quick red when I could probably boost one to red, yeah. No, the problem starts out in Moore's field, yeah. Sounds about right, but blow me if I can work it out right. Is it possible to get quick play uh, for Twitch mode and official? I'm playing quick play, quick play Twitch mode. Maybe not with a full lobby. I think you have to do a little bit of a workaround on it. Yeah, we don't often want people to be randomly dropped into uh, Twitch mode if they can avoid it. And it's kind of more of an opt-in, but... Do you enjoy playing Sister the Thorn now? I find her unironically way more fun. I don't mind her, but... Um, I have the tendency to be told that I am a toxic elf main, so I try not to play elf too much. <laughs> That's a classic. I used to be so polite to my friends when I played Verm, and then I learned how to play elf, and that was the end of me being polite. Oh, thanks. Hi. Hello. Is there any chance to get a um, loadout manager? Uh, integrated into the base game. Yeah, I, I, there's definitely a chance. Um, you know, we just did a big, a big bunch of uh, QOL stuff, and yeah, that one obviously wasn't quite in the list. But I know it's been, uh, it's been looked at by people. Um, we've got some other stuff I think we want to do first, and of course, like I was mentioning earlier, or we mentioned earlier, we have shuffled some resources onto sort of getting Dark Tide out the door um, in the best state it can be. Um, so there'll be some sort of uh, less frequency than like you or I would hope for, but um, yeah, maybe in the future. I know, I know, we'd like to do more QOL stuff. There's, there's always, always more to do, and that's definitely on the, on the table. That's a nice use of a wall. See, look, hedge. That's a good hedge.
Yeah, there are some uh, like caption customization things that help with that sort of stuff. But I think um, Nikadamos was talking more about sort of directionality to the um, some of the stingers and stuff. So when something spawns, it kind of gives you a clue as to what direction that thing might be in for uh, people who are more hard of hearing. Um, so I think I think that's what they were going for. But yeah, we have done some stuff, and there's definitely more we could do and more we'd like to do. Um, sort of make make things more accessible for people. I think I hear accessibility. Mm. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> what is the game engine? Stingray, isn't it? Yeah, it's like a fork of a custom fork of uh, Stingray, which was Bit Squid. Um, and I think it's no longer actively developed. But we, we kind of carried on working with it. Evolving it and tweaking it. I heard monks. There they are. Yeah, there's a bit of history of, uh, about the engine on, uh, on uh, Wikipedia. It's worth checking out. Uh, we've been involved from quite the early days with the engine and we still are. Un Unrat engine five. <laughs> yeah, I would. I would probably recount some of the story, but I'd be afraid of getting some of the details wrong and being lambasted as I leave this room. So, I'll leave you to do the reading. Um, so, can't really talk about much about the engine side for Dark Tide. Um, we, I'm sure we will be able to talk a bit more about it um, once we really get into the thick of talking about the game. Um, uh, Yintin asks about um, the Chinese server. So the game doesn't necessarily work on uh, like a, like a client-server model in, in that sense. It's not. We don't have dedicated servers located around the world. Um, it's done on a client. Like, in, in simpler terms, it's kind of a P2P game. It, it's actually a listening server where a player hosts the server themselves and other people's connect to it. Other people connect to it. Um, so if there are in, like issues with like connectivity on in the, in the region where you play, then it might be a breakdown of communication from your machine to another person, the, the people you're playing with. Um, so we don't have a lot of control oh. over, over that, um, I'm afraid. I mistimed that. Um, will we get Sienna's new career before uh, Dark Tide? Um, we, we can't really go into specifics of when it'll be, um, but we did mention earlier that we're, we're, we're not going to be um, releasing Sienna's uh, sort of career within the cadence you're kind of used to with the careers, which is sort of five to seven or six to seven months. Um, because a lot of We've, we've kind of diverted a lot of resources to sort of getting Dark Tide out the door on time and, and uh, as well as we can. Um, so we've got more content coming before before then, but as to the nature of what it is, um, it's too soon to say. If I hit come here, it's by accident. I don't have the timer set on. Oh. oh, I don't remember hitting my my ult, but you know, we'll take it, I guess. Oh, it happens. Uh, how often is there a stream? We, I think we try to stream every two weeks at the moment. Um, it's likely we might try and up that. Um, uh, in the future, we're working through some of our goals for streaming and streaming plans. And if you have thought on what you'd like, thoughts on what you'd like to see on our streams, 
um, do let us know. Like earlier on, we asked if people would be cool watching us play other games like Deep Rock or or whatever, really. Um, by all means, just uh, fill up forums, send us emails, send us send us messages telling us what you'd like to see on a stream or if you'd like to see a stream more or what you'd expect of a Fat Shark stream. Um, and we'll do what we can. We actually were talking about doing a DOG stream, weren't we? Hmm. Yeah, I think it'd be good fun. It's a great game. It doesn't have dwarves named Barden, though. That is true. It has a lot of dwarves. <laughs> it does have a lot of dwarves. Barden would fit right in. Hmm. Besides Sienna's career, is there anything else planned for Vermintide? Yes. Yeah. Can we say what it is? No. Nay. <laughs> Bard in cameo in DRG. Uh, you'll have to mail, uh, send a mail to Games Workshop about that one. You have to convince them, not us. <laughs> what is the location of the fat check? We are here. Uh, we're in Sweden. We're in Stockholm. Sienna, the last uh, major update for V2. Um, no, there's lots of stuff I think we want to do. Um, we're never going to... I mean, we won't be able to talk about what's in the pipeline right now. And uh, No, we just have to see how things go, really. Um, if you want more stuff, just tell us what you want. We'll see what we can do. Um, you know, we've got, I'm sure, decades of stuff we, we, we could do, but it's not always feasible to carry on doing it, you know. Um, Maybe Dark Tide swallows up the entire audience who plays Vermintide. We just don't know. Like, it, it, it could entirely happen. So, um, never say never, never say yes, never say no. Um, non committal waffle answer, I'm afraid. Okay, I'm not getting hit by you. Can we get more maps uh, from V1 and V2? Which maps? Were you thinking about in particular? Any, any, any in particular you would want to see move from uh, or remastered or slightly reworked from V1 to V2? If there are, let us know in the chat. I know exactly the one they're going to say. Uh, yep. Yep. Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> okay. Death on the Reich was really cool. Really different. I mean, that's it. They were all, all the ones you've listed there were really, really cool. What am I saying? All the maps we do are cool. Well, apart from World Watch. We don't talk about that. Sorry, whoever designed that. That's a nice wall. That's a nice hedge. Thanks. Which hedge am I talking about? Up for chat to decide. I have a new respect for people who play in this room on stream because it is really bright and hard to see. <laughs> and warm. I guess I'm wearing quite a thick shirt and a hoodie. That's probably my first mistake. Oh, someone mentioned love on the right. Did oh we, no, we no, chat? We, no chat? we don't talk about that. Yeah. I was a Reddit mod when that first came out. Aye, aye, aye. And I, 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 we, I remember sitting there with the other bots. What do we do with this exactly? Mm. It was something. It was, that's a way to put it, yeah. It was something, and then it just never left. People made recordings of it, and it just wouldn't die. <laughs> cursed. It still haunts. Cursed, cursed community. I'm pretty moments. sure it still haunts Reddit. 
can hear echoes. Oh. It's gonna be content, content. <laughs> See, Iggy, Iggy, Iggy knows what I like. <laughs> you know, I drank that hoping that they were plague monks and they did not. There they are! Can you tell I don't have my social wheel on the correct timer? I'm just spamming nonsense. <laughs> Yeah, Bard and X brushes is a good one. It's a good love story. Yeah, we released uh, Bard in Songbook like two years ago. I mean, I know I got mine. asked if it's difficult porting uh, maps from Vermintide 1 into 2. Yeah, I mean, it's much harder than if you were just copy, like, if you were trying to make them exactly the same. It's as much, almost as much work as actually making a new map. The only thing you don't have to do is kind of come up with a layout of it. But in terms of the work involved in implementing it, it is, it is a lot of work. And I think we did it. Oh, um, do I have unlimited bombs? Yes, I do. Always. Um... Oh, no, I don't. We did do a dev blog <laughs> that kind of goes into some of the details about it. Um, if you have a dig through uh, vermintide.com slash uh, news, I think it is. And uh, the search there might help. Um, but if not, have a flick through. There was, a, there was an interesting dev blog about, about moving the maps. There's a lot of texture work. There's a lot of things that... Because we changed how things work in the sort of tooling in Vermintide 2 for making and uh, creating levels. Um, yeah, I can. I'm very well assured that it's not as easy as uh, Control C, Control V. Oh no! <laughs> I should have saved my bombs instead of memeing with them. Um, will there be crossover content from Verm to Dark Tide at the V1 skins and V2? Um. I mean, pro probably not, although they are separate universes and, and like controlled separately and handled separately and considered like separate things entirely by um, by Games Workshop and of course by us as well. So I don't think we'd see um, like anything that you own in V2 or V1 becoming available in Dark Tide directly. It's not to say that necessarily... Uh, Owning V2 won't grant you anything in Dark Tide. I, I couldn't rule that off the table, but it probably wouldn't be something from the game that you can use in, in Dark Tide. Oh, hello. Uh, 
Now, if I could rework any one non-DLC career, who would I change and why? Probably Pyro. Um, oh, it's a hook. Just because it means I'd get less emails about us having to rework Pyro. <laughs> um, but that's that's purely selfish, I think. Um, but, you know, in that, in that vein, it would make a lot of people happy, I guess. Um, otherwise, they wouldn't be emailing me to ask if we could do that. Um, like, it's not so much on me. It's not what I want from the game, but really we try and convey what you all want. And I, I guess that is a, co a common thread. Just make a break for it. You can do it. Clutch. Ooh, that was close. So what if the illusion is a little bit vicious? Builds character. If I could add one thing to the game, uh, personally, what would it be? B, uh, steam tank, steam tank drive assault fire. It's easy. I think that's gonna be my last one. Bit cooked. Yeah. Well, that's who I would work. I would work Zealot into a steam tank. Hmm. Yeah, makes sense. Is it Hedge's turn to play now? Nay. <laughs> I think we've been at this for two hours nearly. Um, I think it's time for. Time to wrap it to up. Wrap it up, I think. Um, but we we'll be back at this soon, though. Um, at most two weeks. Hopefully, I'll be able to join then as well. Um, I'm I'm getting a setup uh, in my home office, so that'd be nice. Because um, this has been fun. It's been fun. Yep, and you will need to message the Fat Shark Games Twitch account. Uh, wackiest whale and tell us what cosmetic you want mm -hmm. and we will put it in your account we will, f we will figure that out for you um do i need to i need to transition somewhere I don't know. i'm a master streamer thank you for the games guys thank you for the carries i appreciate it gg gg good games yeah Especially with the difficulty. Uh. It's definitely a different setup. It's definitely a different mm -hmm. setup. I realized how spoiled I am, and I understand why a lot of PC players prefer to like play on their own setup. Mm -hmm. Console players have the advantage of the bear. Controller is a controller. Yeah, the controller is a controller is a controller, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Um, but yeah, thank you all for tuning in to today's stream. It's been really good fun. It's been nice to be back. Um, it's been nice to be hanging out with uh, my esteemed colleague. I should have been wearing the hat. Not that I was wearing a hat. Um, but yeah, it's been fun. Thank you for joining us today. Um, we will see you in probably two weeks. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but until then, be good. Slay rats. And uh, take care of yourselves. Yeah. Ciao. All right. Take it easy, guys. Bye.